Hey y'all, welcome to or welcome back to my channel. My name is Jenny. You don't ever know what you're gonna get up here, but you will get the truth. Today's video, oh, I'm so excited. Look what was on my front porch waiting for me. The Physician's Formula Breakfast Club. Y'all, this was one of my favorite, favorite movies. So, I, I broke my no-buy. I'm on a no-buy. Um, <clears throat> but, when this collection came out and I was seeing it all over line, I was just, oh man, I would love to have that. And I was scrolling on Amazon and they had it marked down to $29. That's right, y'all. $29. Look, I got pure chill bumps. <laughs> So, I bought it, and I want to make sure that it came with everything that was I thought. So, I'm going to open it up, and it comes with, I hope that up my big old head. It comes with two face palettes, an eyeshadow palette, mascara, and three lipsticks. So, and then the inside of the box... Is all um, everything from the Breakfast Club. Let's see. I'm gonna put y'all on hold. I'm gonna slap some makeup on my face and then we're gonna play with this palette. All right, y'all. So I got the big box opened. I put a little bit of uh, foundation on. I just used this um, Misha. cushion magic cushion and I don't even number 23 is all it says is the shade it's a little pale for me but it's all right now the collection came with let's see it came with all this stuff so you get three lippies mascara an eyeshadow palette and two face palettes. This is the Breakfast Club Saturday Detention Face Palette, Volume 2, and this one says Volume 1. Well, when I opened them up, this is what, this is Volume 2, and this is Volume 1. They, and I'm scratching my head at this, they all have the exact same names. The Brain, the Princess, the Athlete, Class of 84, the Rebel, and the Basket Case. I don't know if one is supposed to be a light and one a deep. I don't have a clue. But, at any rate, I'm going to go in with This is so strange. They are literally not that, and I know they got the plastic on them, but they are literally not that far apart. So, I'm not gonna open the volume one. I'm not gonna open this one. I'm just gonna put this one to the side. Just stick it right there and hope it don't fall. And I'm gonna just gonna go in with this one. And let me take the plastic off of it. There we go. That might be a little bit better to see. And the eyeshadow palette, which looks like this. And it is called Being Bad Feels Pretty Good. So, we're going to do an eye look with this. Oh, this brings back memories, y'all. I even had a shirt recently that said, it had up here, it said, Sincerely Yours. And then it had a picture of um, all the kids. And at the bottom, it says The Breakfast Club. So, 
It's just kind of a coming of age movie, I think. This doesn't have very many mats in it. So I'm gonna go, wow. That's really pigmented. So we're just gonna do a simple eye look. The only physician's formula eye product or eye shadows that I've used were what came in that um the butter collection big box. It came it had all the blushes, all the bronzers and eyeshadows and lip balms in it and the shadows in it they were not very well they weren't very good it might just been because it was in that you know all in one palette but <clears throat> this seems to be blending out pretty good of course it's just one one shade that I've used so far, but it seems to blend pretty good. Now, I'm gonna take a smaller brush and go in, if I can find my smaller brush that I use. Where are you hiding it? It's hiding up here. Well, hide away. We'll use this one. And I'm just going to go in with that same shade, but I'm just going to pack it on to kind of get it a little bit deeper. Same color. Just going to pack it in. There we go. That works like I want it to. We need a little bit. There we go. And some beautiful shimmer shades. Mm, that shimmer shade's not looking very promising. <laughs> but, oh, now that one is. That copper is pretty. This is pretty gold. And the one I wanted to use, which is this one, is not really coming off. see this first shade let me well this is very disappointing this shade right here which is the shade We've been brainwashed. It's not. They must have brainwashed them when they uh, put this shadow together. Because it ain't working. Let me wet the brush first and then go in. I don't like to do that. Because I feel like it might mess up the shadow. I usually like to get it on my brush and then wet it. I am getting very little payoff. So, that's a dud. That's so disappointing because it's such a pretty shade. Well, this is more of a satiny. We'll try this one. Okay, yes. Hello, pigment. See? That's what I'm talking about. I'm still going to wet it. And... Pop that right on top. And we'll come on this side. And do it right there. We'll 
us some of y'all's favorite movies. Nostalgic movies. Mine are obviously The Breakfast Club. And I absolutely cannot flip through the channels and not stop and watch Shawshank Redemption. Shawshank is my probably in my top five movies. The Green Mile. Wizard of Oz is number one and will always be number one since I was little. going to kind of build on some of this shimmer out of some of these shades in this palette. I feel it crumbling down my face as I'm putting it on. So. Let's try this one. This is pretty light. Let's see, I think this is gonna be like that daggone other one. Did it lighten it any? Right. Well, this is very disappointing, but. I guess that's just Physicians Formula eyeshadows. They just aren't. Up to par, I suppose. Of course, I didn't go in with every single one, but I'm not impressed at all. So, unless you are a collector or reviewer or whatnot, I don't recommend this palette at all. I mean, you can see how hard I've, especially this shade, I mean, it is... There's nothing, I mean, I'm digging and it comes off on the finger, but it barely comes off on my hand. So, being bad feels pretty good. More of a dud for me, but... Now, let's go in the face palette, now that I've spent too much time on these eyeballs, and let's get a bronzer, and there's two bronzers. This one looks like it's got a little bit of shimmer in it, which is the class of 84, so, and then this is the athlete. I'm going to go in with a little bit of this one. Okay, whoa, that is Pigment City. I think this might be too much <laughs> tapping. I'm barely tapping. Let me put a little bit on this side. And then kind of blend it. Wow, <laughs> that was a lot of pigment and some kick up in the pan, you can see right there. So, I'm gonna take an 
I'm gonna go in with that this one now the athlete it's a little bit lighter I'll go on the other side it's not nearly as dusty and kind of bronze up a little bit warm up my face yeah this is nowhere near as pigmented as that um, class of 84 is And I'm using a Wet n Wild um, Pac-Man <laughs> brush. This is one of my favorite brushes. I love it. All right. And, okay, that's a pretty bronzer. Now, for the blush, there's two choices for blushes. I'm going to do one on one side and one on the other. I'm not going anywhere today. So this is Sincerely Yours. I'm gonna put right here. Mm, that's pretty, that's a pretty color. And let's see, let me get another blush brush and We'll go in with the princess on this side. And it's very pigmented too. It's just more corally. still so confused by these two volume one and volume two I mean I assumed that there would be a variety you know maybe different names but they're all the same names which is so confusing or either you know, this be dark and this be light, so to speak. I don't know. I don't reckon I'm supposed to know. Now, for highlighter, I'm going to go in. I think this is going to be too dark, but we're going to swatch them. So this is the, yeah, that's way gold. This is the basket case, and this is the brain. Uh, let me swatch them here. I don't know if you can. The basket case is way too dark for me. So I'm just going to go in with the brain. Which was, is that white? It's got a gold. Very powdery. But it goes on good. But it does have a powdery. I am not liking these eyes. I'm not liking that palette for the eyes at all. Eyeshadow. Mm, that's, that's. Just taking my foundation brush and kind of tapping it in a little bit. All right, blushes and bronzers in this really like highlighters. Even that is is too dark on me. So I'm gonna put you right there, and I'm not gonna open the mascara because I have too many opened already. But I will open these lipsticks. This one is in the shade. Now I'm going to put my spectacles back on. This one is in the shade. I don't like Mondays. So, let's put this Okay. This is 
definitely 90s nude, 80s nude, very corally. That's this color. Now, uh, let's try this next one. It's called um, The Princess. So let's see what color you are. That looks to be. Oh, wow. Definitely pink. I'll swatch these on my hands as well. And this last one is The World is an Imperfect Place. You can say that again. Ooh. Let's see. Let's see what you look like. These are not very creamy. Yeah. These are definitely not my, my vibe. But they are pretty. And let's see. Let me swatch them. They are not creamy at all. They're not uncomfortable, but they're not. And I, this is the first time I've ever tried Physician's Formula Bullet Lipsticks. I do have, um, some of the liquid lipsticks. All right. That is all three of them swatched. This is the palette, the eye palette. And this is the look that I was able to create this eye always gives me trouble and it's watering right much on the end so that's not again that's not a shadow it's fault that's me and my anatomy but anyway that's the look I was able to come up with lower the light a little bit. Maybe you can see it a little bit better. Alright, guys. The face palette. Right there. And this is the other face palette. And I may do a comparison in another video or I may just leave this be and gift it to somebody else that likes the breakfast club all right guys that's it for today's video I hope y'all stuck around to the end we're almost at a hundred y'all all right be beautiful be kind and I will see you in the next one bye guys